Alright uh, bros, what's up? Welcome back to another Lipton Log. Today we're on week 7, day 3. Kind of like a more, it's more the uh, like lower intensity like accessory day, I suppose. It's probably the best way of describing it. You're pretty familiar with the day by now, it's not any different from uh, week 1, day 3. Anywho, so uh, we had 5 sets at 150 for 3 reps. And we had some incline bench, which I didn't do with dumbbells, I did a machine, which I actually recorded today. I don't think I recorded them before. Uh, and then some hat squats, chest rows, and leg raises, which I didn't record. But everything else I did record today. Wait, I think. Maybe. Maybe not the rows. I can't remember. Anyway. Um, yeah. Blah, 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 blah. Squats felt very, almost kind of easy today. I don't know why. Um, but I didn't really feel like I was struggling at all with the squats. Obviously, first set I did uh, no belt, no sleeves. Just just because I felt like giving it a go without any of those things. And I didn't feel too bad. But fine, I'd say. Not too grindy, but grindy enough, I would say. A little bit of kneeing. I think I did... Uh, Change my foot positioning a little bit on the like the next set. I think I had my toes put into it. Oddly, as you can see, I got one foot not in the same angle as the left other foot, which isn't a big deal, I don't think. But as you can see, this is a sleeved and belted set. The rest of the sets are sleeved and belted. But yeah, I think I have my feet a little bit straighter and. Not necessarily too closer together, but definitely a lot straighter. Yeah, they felt really good today, which I'm quite happy with, which is a nice break. Obviously, Monday will be a quite a heavy, heavy day for squats. And again, I'm pretty happy with my form. We'll have a look at the bottom. So, not really any sort of butt wink, I don't think. I'm pretty the back looks relatively straight. Um, the bar is potentially a little bit further forward. But obviously, the angle isn't great. It's just kind of hard to tell, I suppose. But overall, it felt really, really nice today. So, I'm very happy with that. And this is the last set I recorded. I thought I'd do both. I thought I would do both sides. There we go. Let's articulate my words properly, shall we? Uh, but yeah, I think that's sort of the, the fourth and fifth set. I can't remember really. Uh, but really, yeah, they felt no harder than the first sets. So it almost felt like a deload day for squats. I think this might actually be a better angle. Kind of, but again, you know, I think I'm hoping that is below parallel, so that should hopefully meet comp standards. Obviously, I know this is nowhere near my actual, you know, uh, one rep max weight, but obviously, you know, I want to make sure I stay in the habit of squatting to depth, regardless of the weight kind of thing. So, I hope that is deep enough for comp standards. I feel like it should be. But yeah, so as I said already, squats felt. Really, really nice today. I'm very, very happy with. And some accessory stuff. Uh, I think I had 55 loaded up on here. I didn't want to do dumbbells anymore because when I did dumbbells before, um, I really, I struggled to get the dumbbell up into position, and I almost like sort of fucking I don't know, felt like I ripped my arm off almost at one point because how bad my arm was. So that sucked. Yeah, just uh, it was three sets of six, I believe. No, three sets of twelve, sorry, or ten. And my last set, I did twelve, something like that, anyway. Uh, tens. Yeah, I think I just did ten then. But like my last set, I did more though. But I don't know. Um, got some hack squats. Nothing too exciting. Ninety kg. Just very nice and grindy. I think my last set of these, I forgot to log it again. I did like a lot more than I needed to. I think I ended up doing fifteen, but again, I forgot to log it properly. But yeah, just getting very nice and deep and just trying to make sure I'm really getting my knees, that, you know, pressing my knees forward as well. 
I have no idea what I was checking my watch for then. But uh, yeah, they were fun. And then yeah, just some rows, machine rows. A bit more lat and I guess rear delt going on there. Again, to help create a better shelf for the squat. I'm, I'm assuming that's mainly what it's for. Was to help get a better shelf with the squat and, you know, just strengthen up the certain areas for like the deadlift and stuff like that. And yeah, that pretty much wraps up the day. Obviously, the video's just going to loop through. But yeah, that wraps up day three. I'm feeling pretty good so far. I think we have one more week left and then it's test week. Um, so tomorrow we've got bench. I'm not so sure exactly if it'd be idea if you guys can give me some advice quickly uh, in the comments with regards to like what I sh how much I should increase my reps to next week. So for example, um, the squat on Monday, it's asking or recommending that we do a, s a heavy single at RPE eight and a half, eight point five. Uh, my last squat I did was 180 for one and if I remember rightly that was a 7.5 um if i were to say go to my sort of like one max calculator thingy majiggy and look at my my squat what was 190 um my estimated kind of like two rep max for example is 180 so i'm guessing you know to one and a half, eight point five, RPE kind of thing, would probably be like what one eighty five, I guess. But I'm not sure if I should do like a one eighty five or attempt my last one at max weights and do one ninety kind of thing on this last week that I have, in the hopes that it will then give me more of a likelihood of increasing my one at max on the one at max test day. I'm really not sure how I should go about this next week of training kind of thing and how much I should put up my list by, whether it should be just like 5 kilos or 10 kilos. Uh, but yeah, if you guys have, any, you know, have done this program or have any kind of vague idea of what I should go about that, that'd be really appreciated. If not, I'll just wing it, see how I feel on the day and take it from there. But uh, yeah, see you guys tomorrow for bench day. Goodbye. I hope training's go well. It does.